writer's log supplemental it's Saturday day 10 I know Colleen hates me I can see it in her eyes and I hate her too so I'll <laughs> It's time to go. Get you. Time to go. Want to go down? Are you made of sugar? <laughs> so today's the day we were all packed, but we are waiting out the rain. Still raining. Muppet, when's it gonna stop raining? Boogie for you though, baby. Good morning, Internet. It is 7.23 in the morning, and welcome to my channel. <laughs> we are at the Calaboogie Motor Inn. This is day two. Skies are looking a little... a little better than yesterday. The wind is blowing hard today. This is the lovely and talented Colleen. She's ready to go. Anything to say, Colleen? Well, I hope it's not too windy today because I don't like the wind, but it's not supposed to be. And I hope it warms up a little bit and I really need a cup of tea. She needs a cup of tea. Colleen is riding the beautiful Indian Scout on this adventure. And I'm taking the Euro Trash BMW GS. All right, enough of that rot. We'll see you soon. City today. So we're going to take the scenic route. Probably takes about five, six hours. We will catch up later. Good morning, folks. This is our last night in La Belle Provence with my belle. It's a bit of a belle theme last night. We ate at La Bella Did Bistro. Oh, yes. Yes. Uh, anyway, we're staying here at uh, Sepia Hotel in 
some French town just outside of Quebec City. But what's exciting is what's to come. We are crossing the seaway on one of those bridges. Not sure which one yet. I think it's the one on the left. And it's going to be an exciting day. We're off to Grand Falls. New Brunswick. New Brunswick. First time I've been that far east. Yeah, about uh, 350 kilometers again today. So about four or five hours of, uh, of riding. Anyway, that's it for today. Children drunk lemonade And the morning lasted all day All day And through an open window came Like Sinatra in a younger day Pushing the town away Said in winter 1963, it felt like the world would freeze with John F. Kennedy and the Beatles. Okay, good morning. It is Sunday? Is it Sunday? Monday. Monday. August 2nd. Monday, August 2nd. It is our last push on to PEI. We've got a lot of miles to cover today, so it's going to be a long time in the saddle. And I think it's going to be a little bit longer because it's going to rain all day. Anyway, we're going to take it slow and careful. We won't be filming. Um, we're just going to get there on boring highways. See you soon.
downtown Prince Edward Island. Haven't logged in for a couple of days. We missed logging uh, yesterday. Uh, we got in two nights ago, super soaked. So we had uh, a big uh, task drying out and everything. But we've had a fantastic day here on the island, hosted by Charlie Scott. Took us all over the North Shore. Saw fishing boats and little fishing towns and bays and lobster traps and all these beautiful colored houses and stuff. It's fantastic. Anyway, we'll post pictures and all that stuff. Uh, today we are heading to St. John, uh, no, St. Andrews by the Sea. It's about 420 kilometers. Uh, it should be a good weather day. Um, and uh, hopefully uh, we don't have more rain like we did a couple of days ago. Anyway, this is the lovely and talented Colleen. And this is the place we stayed at. It is, I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's called, uh, it's called the Sydney, Sydney Boutique. Boutique Inn and Suites. Fantastic. Uh, a little more expensive than the roadside schlogs we've been in, but worth every penny and we pampered ourselves for the last two days. All right, that's enough of that. Ciao for now. Up from the street, got a beautiful sound. It's got a beautiful beat. It's a beautiful noise going on everywhere, like the clickety clack of a train on a track. It's got rhythm to spare. It's a beautiful noise. Sound that I love, and it fits me as well as a hand in a glove. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Somebody's a little sleepy. Oh, <laughs> are you filming me? <laughs> yeah, I'm tired. One more hour to go, guys. I was trying to get it done, but we are in St. John. We're just doing the highway and. Uh, we're at a little rest stop here, having some Red Bull, trying to wake up. <laughs> Lovely helmet head, huh? All right, baby, last push, almost there. It's to the beat of the night. It's a beautiful noise. And it's a sound that I love. And it makes me feel good. Like a hand in a glove. again we didn't uh, videotape from the hotel because it was very early in the morning and we didn't want to disturb anybody so we got an hour under our belts and we're just stopping for a coffee we're trying to outrun the rain and uh, get up to uh, Riviera de Luc today so it's a long ride and uh, we're not gonna be videotaping any of it because it looks like we've got a, another rainy day but hopefully the sun will start shining by the time we get there. Catch you on the other side. Good morning. We are at uh, Riviere de Loup in Quebec, waiting for the ferry. Of course, motorcycles get to go to the front of the line. 
and uh, we're heading over to uh, Saint Simeon, Saint Simeon, something like that. Sim, no, Simeon on the other side. Saint Simeon on the other side, and then we're riding about 150 kilometers to uh, Sagaguaganagagwe. <laughs> something we cannot pronounce uh, <laughs> anyway uh, we are stoked about this ferry rides on motorcycles are always a ch an adventure but isn't this pretty here we are in Riviera de Loop there's a nice little beach a little restaurant spot and we stayed up on that hill you can see it on the GoPro but way up there on that hill on a great little motel anyway enough chatter for today wish us luck I'm here in Chicoutimi, Quebec, Saguenay. Beautiful drive from Tadoussac, something like that. Couple ferries today. And uh, we landed in this kind of dated, but unbelievable riverside motel. And I just got the drone up successfully. Lovely and talented Colleen. Got a drink, ordered some pasta. Mm. Life is good. I went down to the place where I knew he lay waiting under the marble. I said, 
Papa, I'm frightened. The thunder and the lightning. I'll never come through this alone. He said, I'll be with you, my coat wrapped around you, my hand on your head when you go. And the night came on. It was very calm. I wanted that. Writer's Log Supplemental. It's Saturday, day 10. I know Colleen hates me. I can see it in her eyes. And I hate her too. But anyway, we're heading uh, we're heading south today to Trois-Rivières from this beautiful northern Quebec city of uh, Saguenay. Um, I won't wax on here. 350 kilometers on the bike. Just a beautiful setting. We had a nice night here right at this picnic table looking over this beautiful place. Just a fabulous, uh, fabulous spot here in uh, northern Quebec. Anyway, talk soon, folks. <laughs> There's the man of the hour. <laughs> Here we are somewhere in Quebec, heading for Eganville. Where are Hi. we? Honey? Where are we? We're in uh, just outside uh, Saint Germain. Germain. We Germain. wanted to avoid Montreal. We're heading to Eganville, back into Ontario. And we still love each other, right, honey? We do. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be honest with you, real talk here. This is getting hard. On the way back, it's not as exciting as on the way there. So uh, we just wanna be home, but it's too far to drive all in one, one go. So we're slugging it out, but uh, we're tired, we're sore. We just wanna be home. <laughs> We've made it to Eganville. Here we are at this beautiful hotel. Reminds me of Schitt's Creek. Okay, so we were so not about that. Now we found ourselves a very lovely room. We hightailed it out of there. Down the road, found a lovely room. There's our little babies out there. Can you see them? Can you see them? There they are. All is good in the hood. Are you feeling a little better, honey? Two thumbs up. I can't stop this feeling deep inside of me. Girl, you just don't realize what you do to me when you hold me in your arms so tight. You let me know. All right, we are in Baysville, Ontario. It's a couple hours away from home. It's a cute little town. Very famous for some quirky memorial to a local who must have rode in the bike. And uh, it's Nelly's Bakery Cafe type of thing. There's also a really nice uh, little weir here in Dam, which uh, seems to be a lot of them in these small Ontario cottagey towns. Anyway, my lovely, lovely wife. Lovely ride through Algonquin Park on our way back. Yep. And two hours left 
of our 4,330 kilometer adventure. Almost it, there. It was, yeah, we're almost there. Take care. I just stay here home it was a freaking hot one <laughs> we're melting but what a great trip it was uh full of lots of adventure i think today was the hardest day for me the wind and the heat i would rather ride in the rain anyway that's the end of our story hope you enjoyed i'm high on believing that you're in love with me All the good luck when we're all alone. Keep it up, girl.